So, uh, what's your name? My name is Sherwin. Sherwin, where are you from? I'm from Seattle. Ah, from Seattle, bien bien. And um, do you know something about Sasquatch? I don't know too much about Sasquatch except he's big and furry and there's a lot of commercials about him with uh, yes. beef jerky. There are people who hike with poles and drink their meals and people who feed on Jack Link's jerky. Because in life, you either run with Sasquatch or you run from Sasquatch. Okay, and do you think that I'm going to watch it in Canada? Uh, I don't think in, in Canada, somewhere here in the United States, ah, in the okay. Northwest. Okay. Chavales, ya estoy llegando a Seattle, la ciudad de las nubes, como la suelen llamar. Voy a preguntar a todo el mundo sobre Bigfoot, que aquí le llaman Sasquatch. A ver si en estos días de descanso consigo alguna pista de por qué no estoy encontrando a Bigfoot, dónde puedo encontrarle y si la gente es capaz de decirme pues algo sobre él, por ejemplo, de dónde viene la leyenda de Bigfoot. Nothing's new and nothing's changed. Nothing ever stays the same. It over and over and over again What's come over you? What's got into you? You impossible creature you Sasquatch does exist. He's here in the Pacific Northwest. Are you sure? Absolutely positive. Did you see him? I haven't seen him, but I've I've had people that I know that have seen him. Oh, and it's so big. Big. It's dangerous. It stings. It stings. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it's dangerous. Could could he hurt me? Could he hurt you? Yes. Or not? Well, he's like. This tall. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if, he okay. if he wanted to, yeah, but usually a Sasquatch stays away from humans, and when you see one, it's only for 10 seconds, usually. Only 10 seconds. And will that Sasquatch protect the forest? Absolutely. Why? That's its home. It oh. doesn't feel comfortable out in a city. It's more comfortable in like a forest in the woods. Oh, There's a, a story of when Sasquatch, um, a guy was camping alone and his tent just gets picked up by Sasquatch and he got kidnapped by Sasquatch. He, yeah. He yeah. just lifted him up. Lifted him up. Say it again. So say like and he lifted <laughs> him up. <or> <laughs> he lifted him up over wow. his shoulder. And uh, is, does he is alive? And then he carried him to like this weird secluded canyon with a family where there was actually a female and then a younger male and female. And he kept the him trapped over with the, yo the younger children who were all about him, but they were not going to let him leave. And then he ended up tricking his way out of getting out of there using some uh, tobacco. And tobacco. Um, yeah, he, he tricked the um, Bigfoot into eating a bunch of tobacco. Yeah. Because they'll just like eat things, and he was acting like the, one of his things that he had was really good was this tobacco. And he stunned the Bigfoot by hi, tricking him into eating his tobacco and was able to run away from him. Estamos en el sitio de Estados Unidos con más bacterias por metro cuadrado. ¿En dónde estamos, Teresa? En la pared del chicle, en Seattle. La pared de los chicles. Fijaros la cantidad de chicles que puede haber. Es muy asqueroso. Y en, en mitad de la pared de los chicles, una 
pizzería. I felt them around and I can hear them around because they communicate yes. telepathically. <laughs> yeah. They, there's a bunch of them by our house. There's like a family a by family my mom's Sasquatch. house. And Sas Sasquatch. Sasquatch has got a girlfriend or boyfriend. Oh. It just I don't know about the ones by our house. There's there's a few of them, um, but they're but have both of them. They could they could love anything. Um, they could be they, like us. They fixate they fixate over weird things though. No. They yeah. reproduce still, so they somewhere. So it just would just I don't know. They, in, they're in, very interested in very odd things. In which type of forest Sometimes. I could find the Sasquatch? You know, I had been in Olympics, I have been in Hawk Forest, and I didn't see him. And I'm going to Rainier now. The most... Rainier, um, Oregon? Rainier, Rainier here. Mount Rainier. Yes, okay. Mount Rainier. The best experiences I've had and where they're the most communicative is right where the Redwood Forest starts. There, right? So it at the base of Oregon. Yes. So right at the border of Oregon and Colorado uh, okay. and California, where the redwood forest starts. The red. The red what? Yeah. Big redwood, redwood forest. The big red. Oh, I, yeah. I could imagine. Down like, there on the coast. Yes, like in Star Wars, the the Endor forest. I don't watch Star Wars. I don't know, <laughs> but there's no camping allowed, but you still can just go up and do it. Okay. Um, and you're not supposed to, but you'll find like old logging roads that you can kind of just like, like down in Brookings area. Yes. There's like all these like weird places you can go off up into, like at the very start of the okay. edge of the Redwood Forest. And there's, be, oh, I've had some really interesting experiences there. With very Sasquatch. friendly, very like where they want to communicate. Starbucks es aquí de Seattle y se sabe que es el primer Starbucks porque es el único en el que la sirena se le ve el pecho. ¿Ves? En todo el resto de, de los Starbucks el pelo de la sirena cubre el pecho cuando se empezó a difundir eh, esta, esta cadena. Pero este es el único que vais a ver la sirena con las dos colas y el pecho. Y este es el logo normal que vemos todos donde el pelo de la sirena le cubre el pecho y la cola se ve por los laterales pero no se ve el cuerpo.
they'll eat meat. If <laughs> they'll eat meat on from our food because it's there because they they'll come into your house. Yes. And or like around on things, and they'll just like because they'll they can see where, especially if there's some living by you. They'll watch you and they'll see everything that you do and then the moment you leave they'll come in and they'll they figure out how to like get into your house. It's true. And eat your food and <laughs> play around with your things and find things that they like. But they'll like eat with a PlayStation. Anything in your house. They're like things that they like see that they like find interesting. Like I don't know, weird stuff, shiny things and things that have like really crazy flavors. They're yeah, super smart. They are really, really smart. And um, but they'll come in your house and 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 uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't so. Know. Uh, <laughs>